Hi, I'm Jimit Arora, Research Director with Everest Service Provider Intelligence Practice. The year 2011 has been off to an exciting start and the first 10 days alone have witnessed two acquisitions in the mid-sized offshore IT services landscape. On January 4, Japanese major Hitachi Consulting acquired Hyderabad-based Sierra Atlantic and then on January 10, iGate acquired Patni Computer Services in what is the largest ever acquisition in the Indian IT services industry. We examine the implications of these acquisitions on the future of the offshore IT services landscape. The acquisitions reinforce the market dynamics at play in the Indian IT services landscape. Evolving buyer behavior driven by service provider portfolio rationalization objectives, flight for quality, and risk management requirements have created a preference for partnering with larger service providers. As the market matures, a revenue threshold of US dollar 1 billion is fast becoming table stakes for consideration in large deals. As you see in the slide in front of you, it is therefore no major surprise that despite their relatively larger scale, tier 1 Indian majors continue to grow at a much faster clip than the smaller tier 2 service providers. Sustained growth among the tier 2 service providers is contingent upon creating a differentiated market focus that goes beyond the traditional generalist approach adopted by most Indian IT companies. In the exhibit, you will note that there is no high growth generalist among Indian tier 2 service providers. It is a recognized fact that many Indian IT service providers are struggling and as the market matures, consolidation is a foregone conclusion. However, the fierce independence of the owner operators and the low valuations in light of the economic crisis were preventing deals from happening. Looking forward, have the recent acquisitions opened the floodgates of consolidation in the Indian Tier 2 segment? We think so. For more information on this topic, please visit our website www.everestresearchinstitute.com. Thank you.